In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to delete your OneDrive account. Given the nature of digital storage, it's essential to know how to manage your online presence, especially when it involves your personal data. Microsoft's OneDrive is a fantastic tool for keeping your files securely in the cloud, but there might come a time when you need to say goodbye, whether it's for cleaning up your digital life or moving to a new service. Let's walk through the process step by step to make sure you do it right and understand what it entails. Firstly, head over to the Microsoft homepage. This is where your journey begins. Microsoft is a hub for many services, including OneDrive, so it's important to start here to get directly to your account details. Once you're on the Microsoft page, the next step is to sign in. Look for the sign in option on the page. It should be fairly easy to locate. Clicking this will begin the login process essential for account deletion. Upon clicking to sign in, you'll be prompted to enter your email address. This should be the email associated with your OneDrive and Microsoft account. After entering your email, proceed by clicking Next. The system then requests your password, ensuring that the account belongs to you. Once you've securely entered your password, again click Next. After successfully logging in, you might encounter a prompt asking if you want to stay signed in. For security purposes, it's usually best to click yes if you're on a personal device. This prevents repetitive sign-in requests for future visits, even though you're here to delete your account. However, security is paramount and every little step contributes to it. Next, navigate to All Microsoft after you've accessed your account dashboard. This is like opening your digital door to every Microsoft service you use or have access to. From this broad gateway, you'll want to find and click on OneDrive. This directs you straight to where your files are stored in the cloud. It's like walking into a room full of your digital possessions. Once inside OneDrive, if you're not already signed in automatically, select the sign in option to enter this specific service with your account credentials. This might repeat some steps, but it's crucial for accessing OneDrive specific settings. After signing into OneDrive, locate the home button. It serves as a starting point within OneDrive, allowing you to navigate efficiently throughout your stored contents and settings. Under Home, find and select My Microsoft Account. This option takes you back under the umbrella of your overall Microsoft account settings, but with a focus on OneDrive. In the broader Microsoft account settings, locate and click on your info. This section encompasses information about your account, including personal details and account management options. Within your info, you'll find an option to close account. This is a significant step as it takes you to the page where Microsoft outlines the process and implications of closing your account. It's important to read through these details carefully. Microsoft ensures you're fully aware of what account closure means, including the loss of access to services, subscription data, and the irreversible deletion of all your files stored in OneDrive. Deciding to close your account is a big step that requires careful consideration. Once you've read through the implications and are sure you want to proceed, follow the instructions provided by Microsoft to close your account. This usually involves confirming your identity, acknowledging the loss of data and services, and finally confirming the closure request. Remember, once you decide to close your OneDrive account, it's not just about losing access to your files, it's about ensuring that you've backed up essential data somewhere else first, understanding that you'll lose access to other Microsoft services linked to this account and acknowledging that this decision is final after a short grace period provided by Microsoft for any last minute changes of heart. And there you have it. We've walked through the process of how to delete your OneDrive account carefully and thoughtfully. It's a significant decision that impacts your digital footprint and access to your digital files. Ensure you've considered all aspects before proceeding. If you've decided that it's time to move on from OneDrive, following these steps will ensure a smooth and informed transition. Thank you for joining me today, and don't hesitate to revisit any part of this guide if you need further clarification on the steps involved.